Morning, Captain. Top of the morning to you, folks. Welcome back to vlogs. Ah, today is going to be a good day. Did you guys watch yesterday's vlog where we went and toured this old RV that kind of worked? Kind of is the keyword. Well, we were telling you that we wanted to buy it, and I know all you guys want us to buy this RV, so what do we got? We're here with our friend ha! Benjamin. Ha! We Man. got all the monies here. I don't know if we told you guys, but this RV, what is it, 1970s? Yeah, 76, I think. And it only, it only has 60,000 miles, which I think is pretty impressive. And we got it for a steal, 1,200 bucks. So we got the money here, Andrew 600, my 600. Let's go make this purchase. I am so excited. You? This is gonna be insane. What should we do first? What should we do first to the mods? Dodge. We got her running, so he said we gotta keep it running for like 15 to 30 minutes before you drive or it like shuts off in the middle of the road. <laughs> so yeah, that there's that. <laughs> Any surprises? No, but I'm bound to find many surprises in this thing. <laughs> Trying to think what we want to do. Obviously, we can put like a new sitting area here because there's not much going on, anyways. Yeah, because we got the bed up here. This here as well. And I think a table can fit in this little hole. Oh, it's got like yeah. something going on. So, and then this is for a refrigerator if we want. And then it's just here. there, and then you can be a witness if you want. There's part of it. Oh, I have the other one. <laughs> <laughs> All that money. Well guys, I thought I'd never say this, but we are proud owners of an RV. A 1976 Dodge Sportsman. That's so epic. Obviously, I, we gotta thank you guys for supporting us. We wouldn't be doing this if it weren't for you guys who come back to watch. But like we mentioned earlier, we got so many epic plans with this, and you're gonna help us, so. You guys are gonna love these, this like adventure with this RV. This, man. Yeah. What, what? We just definitely gotta get it tuned up because there are a few things, as you can tell, that are a little funky on it, but. So we definitely have to get new tires. We have to do like a little tune up on the engine. Yeah. But uh, the only thing though is Andrew drove here in his car, but I gotta drive this home. Oh, uh, I've never driven RV really before. Let's hope. At least you did the test drive yesterday, so you're kind of yeah, used to it. I guess I'm kind of used to it, but we've been letting it warm up. So we're going to drive it home. What tip is it at? Is it okay? It's barely warm. Are you serious? <laughs> the temperature. It's like barely, barely. Oh. <laughs> We're testing out the stereo. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but. Why is it so quiet? That is full volume, folks. Wow. What? What? Oh! There we go. We may have a situation here, guys. If it rains. Uh, guys? Come on, wipers. Why don't they turn? Uh-oh. Let's hope it don't rain anytime soon. <laughs> He said he thought he saw something was disconnected. These seat belts are pretty interesting. It's like an airplane. <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, I'm ready. I guess I'll get in my car. Okay. All right, guys, I think it's time to uh, hit the road. We're gonna bring this back to the house and uh, let's see how it drives on the road. Oh, got it in drive. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be filming too much while I'm driving because this is the first time. <laughs> <laughs> I 
All right, we're gonna take it slow today, guys. <laughs> Oh, bump. <laughs> Great Scott, guys. Well, I'm still driving, doing pretty well. Uh, still trying to figure this thing out. De definitely needs a tune-up. Man, this thing is funny. It likes to stall a lot. But the temperature also has not gone up, so not sure how. Oh, see, we just stalled, boys. Well. It won't start now, folks. <laughs> All right, let's put, it's in park. Oh no. Hear that? Yeah. Uh oh We weren't lying when we said this ne thing needed a tune-up. So we're trying to figure out right now. Obviously we're at the intersection. Not fully sure. I think it needs like, because it had to keep on being restarted and stalling i think the batteries drain so i think it needs like a start a jump but this is like not like a major intersection but I'm trying and the steering wheel is kind of locked up like i can't turn so <sighs> all right so we got the engine open we're just gonna get a uh, a battery restart Hoping for yes. <laughs> <laughs> this adventure is starting off just perfect. Yep. See, this are, this is the type of adventures you're gonna get with this bad boy. <laughs> Jumper cables. Nick came. We're gonna connect these to this. Should be back up and running. Hopefully. Here we are. All right. On there. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. that's how it's done. High five. Hey. High five. All right, Dosh, don't fail us now. <laughs> Guys, we oh. made it. I would say a grand total of like seven stalls. <laughs> yeah, this wow. thing definitely needs a tune-up if we're gonna go on adventures. Guys, we first of all we need a name for this thing. And please leave a like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It made it back safe with the help of Nick. How do you feel about this? It needs a tune-up. Yep. <laughs> you yep. ready for adventures in it? But, After the tune-up. Okay. Yeah, but we knew it needed a tune-up, yeah. so that's all right. We knew that's that. It was so cheap. All right, y'all, time to do some cleaning. Comes pre-installed with gloves. Yeah! Yep, to clean it. We got a big old trash bag. And we're gonna have to get rid of all these things. Yeah. So I'm wondering, as we're cleaning out, what sort of surprises yeah, we're gonna find. Any treasure, any, you know. Hoping Rares. treasure. <laughs> Found a few matches, so that's the first treasure. <laughs> yep, this drawer is full of presents. We got an RV carbon monoxide alarm, and then a bunch of lights. And... I don't need this. What is this? This light turns on. What is the point of this, guys? <laughs> Wait, can you see that? See, it turns on. A whole thing of matches. Yeah, that'll come in handy. Clorox wipes. No more. All right. See, I'm not sure what's going on over here, but they got these cooking pans. They definitely have a lot of cabinets. Well, I thought there'd be something in here. Nope. Now to check out the bathroom. Oh no. Ugh, air freshener. We got toilet paper. Oh! What's in there? Half of a vacuum and bleach and... Who's gonna be the first one to take a poo in the toilet? <laughs> Not me! I also noticed that the glove box has a few presents. We got two tools. Oh, we got some axe! Are you serious? It could smell kinda good in here. Ooh, we have matches. We can do an axe fire. 
So I'm cleaning up the cabinets and I notice on this one is a bit peculiar. There's like little locks up here. One on this side too. So I undid it and then it folds this whole cabinet. Here, pull your side. Folds down. And I don't know, is this like another bed? Maybe this is like a storage. Like if you have to get something really big in there? Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't trust this as a bed. You don't want to climb up there and see? No. Oh. <laughs> Somebody's on the roof. Hello? I'm up here. <laughs> Looks like it's sturdy up here, mate. Promise? Don't take a wrong step now. <laughs> and if we take it in the mountains and we want to look at the stars, we come up here. Oh, yeah! Take the ladder. That'd be epic. Also, in one of the cabinets, found these speakers. So this was hanging up somewhere, but these probably aren't that good. Yeah! Turkey, ow! It does hold two people up here. In case the ground gets flooded. Yeah, we can go to higher grounds. <laughs> But this solar panel is convenient back yeah. there. Dang, look like this. Somebody help! Escape! Ah. Oh, that's what that's for. I know it's kind of hard to see the vision for this because, I mean, like, stuff like this. <laughs> and so bad. the carpet all torn up, but trust us. Have you guys seen that show with uh, Chip and Joanna Gaines? What's yep. that called? I don't remember. Or the Property Brothers. They take really bad looking pieces of property and turn them into something beautiful. So <laughs> don't doubt us. Yeah. I mean, we hear your concerns about this going literally just about anywhere and shutting down. But that's why we're going to have a mechanic do his best job and get it running so we don't have any problems. And once we get a mechanic, we'll, we'll, we won't just go straight to the mountains. We'll do some tests around the city right. to make sure that we're <laughs> A-OK. -okay. What the? Aaron? Our first guest. The... Come on in. Welcome. <laughs> so how do you like the seat? Does it go back further? I'm kind of smushed. Um, that I don't think. Oh, oh that uh -huh. one moves. There you go. <laughs> ah, <laughs> safe. <laughs> well guys, this is the end of the vlog. So thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed it, remember, give it a like. I'm just so excited to see what we can do with this RV. I know a lot of you were saying that we should get a different one because this one just looks kind of junky, which I get you, but it's like the nicer ones, they cost more money. So this way I think we can just have more fun. As long as we can get the engine running properly so there's no problems, it should be fun. And we'll see you back here tomorrow. Peace out.